John. It's Abby. I um, just got locked outside with my laptop, so I figured I'd do a video response. To begin with, do you realize it's been like five months since I did a proper video response? I'm sorry. I have seriously let you down in my nerve fighting duties. I think the covers are great. Personally, I'm partial to the yellow. Personally, I'm partial to the yellow. Personally, I'm partial to the yellow. Personally, I'm pa partial to the yellow. Personally, ugh. I forgot how easy it is to get off track when you do these things. And believe you me, I will be first in line on October 16th getting my yellow copy of Paper Towns. John, did you know that I'm a huge fan of your books? I read Looking for Alaska in one night, curled up in bed, and it literally had me weeping for the um, last third of the book. Not. Not in a bad way, it was cathartic. And I read an abundance of Catherines laying on the grass in Central Park in one afternoon, and it was hilarious. I would show you my worn down copies of your books, but I don't have them. I've basically just been sending them around to all my friends since I read them. John, as you know, and I'm sure many of you watching know, hopefully, um, I do an internet show called Songs from a Hat, where people like you send me song titles and then I pick them out of the hat, well, I was looking through some of my song titles yesterday, and I started to notice a trend. Not once, not twice, but three times, someone suggested the Paper Town song as a song title. And this got me thinking of a clever way to market your new book, Paper Towns. You could send me an advanced copy, and I could write a song about it, and then play it for my 4,500 subscribers. Did I say 4,500? I meant, uh, 45 million. Seems like a great deal to me. You get a little promotion, I get a little Paper Towns action. And just so you know, this wouldn't be any, you know, random stupid song. Paper Towns by John Green It hits shelves on October 16th You know, this would be an in-depth, hard-hitting, hard-hitting, <laughs> touching song. Maybe it could be from the point of view of one of the characters. I don't know. I haven't read the book. Either way, it'll most certainly be the best song ever written about a young adult fiction novel. Probably the best song ever written about a novel, you know, period. And maybe, just maybe, the best song ever written. Alright, John, whether or not you uh, buy in on this deal of a lifetime, I will um, be in line. First thing in the morning, October 16th, at my local bookstore. You're awesome. DFTBA mustache. I'm gonna go try to find my spare key now.